a production of the New Jersey Courts. What constitutional amendment provides for freedom of the press, freedom of speech? How about freedom of religion, or the freedom to peaceably assemble? What amendment gives us the freedom to criticize the government? The answer to each question is the same, the First Amendment. This year on Law Day, we recognize the First Amendment and part of what it represents, free speech, a free press, and a free society. The First Amendment protects rights that form the cornerstone of a free society, one that values all of its citizens and recognizes that dissenting views are essential to healthy public discourse. From the first settlers who came to America to practice their religion, to citizens who took a stand against civil injustice, to those who protested our country's involvement in foreign wars, all have been protected by the First Amendment, even when their views were out of step with the majority of their fellow citizens. The First Amendment and the protections it affords are just as relevant today. And it continues to spark debate because speech protected by the First Amendment is not always popular. When citizens burn the American flag in protest, when groups whose ideals we don't agree with use hateful speech and stage protests, when reporters the world over are threatened, it's at those times that the First Amendment reminds us how important free speech and freedom of the press are to a free society. Free speech assures we all have a voice in government, and a free press acts as a check on government. Although basic freedoms protected under the First Amendment have not changed, the platforms we use to exercise those freedoms have. Social media has created a whole new set of concerns, from cyberbullying to the rapid spread of misinformation. Consider this. A 2017 Knight Foundation survey of college students showed students increasingly use social media to express their opinions, but are also increasingly concerned that cyberbullying suppresses free expression. Society once grappled with how to deal with a situation when someone yells fire in a crowded theater and creates a danger. Today, society struggles with the boundary between expressing an opinion and harassment in the digital age. One thing is clear. We know that in the end, the core principles we hold dear from the First Amendment will guide that debate. On Law Day, we have a chance to think about how the First Amendment affects our lives, how it guarantees the rights of others, and what it means to live in a nation that protects free speech and a free press. Thank you for spending some time thinking about those vital issues today.